Alright, what's up guys? Welcome back to another episode of The Long Dark. So after we've almost died twice, um, and then the game was trying to give me a sign, like, with the glitches, but my bow seems to be okay now. I no longer have a thing of matches in front of it, which is good. Um, and I'm here in this kind of safe area. And I was doing a sound test just a minute ago, and I saw a rabbit outside, so I thumped him. And now I have a couple of rabbits to harvest. So, let's harvest some rabbits, break down some wood, and uh, cook up the meat. I think I'm going to try to rest here for a little bit and recover some condition. And, you know, because I really don't want to die. And the game could always throw a bear in front of me. And a bear could kill me. Right now, like, in a hurry. Even a wolf. I'd be afraid a wolf could kill me with this low a condition. So, we're going to play it safe. We've spent too much time on this playthrough to just, like, go out there willy-nilly and die. Something stupid. I've already had too many close calls. Um, I'm going to chill here in the cabin for as long as it takes for me to recover condition. Fortunately, we got to come out here to make fire. I can make a fire at the magnifying. I think we will. I'll try it. God, this takes forever with the magnifying lens. But it will conserve some resources. So well, I'm gonna have to boil some water too. It looks like. So we'll wait till these get done cooking. And firewood I can collect over there. There's some sticks that I can use. Water. We'll boil water. Should have plenty of time. Um, don't have any books to read. Let's go in here. Is any of the stuff that I have? I could drop these. not going to last very long, but I, I'm going to have to try to make it. Like, we need to recover some condition. I could die. And that could be a very, 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 very bad. So, I'm going to go get some firewood just in case. While our water is boiling.
sometimes the music in this game scares me. When it kicks on, I'm like, oh no. Am I gonna die? From the monologue to my death? I wanna live. Right, water is good. Right, we're going inside for the night. I don't have much to do out here, so aside from like break down stuff and leave firewood, but we have firewood now. I could always break these tables down and stuff if I felt so inclined. We we'll have plenty of firewood here. And otherwise Just gonna have to like eat up some of these resources that we were gonna use to travel with. But I'm okay with it. Like as long as we recover some condition. I'm gonna sleep it off. Let's get some good sleep. We have to get like as high a condition as we possibly can. Sleep, past time, whatever I gotta do. Um, I might be able to do a little tool maintenance now. Uh, let's see here. Can I? Eh, we'll wait till daylight. I'll go ahead and pass a few hours. Just chilling. We'll wait till in the morning. I'll go back outside. We'll look for some more rabbits. You know, we'll just hang around this cabin try to stay as safe as possible. Oh, I uh, lost the bed. Not trying to risk our life before we can actually get to like Timberwolf Mountain because of just some stupid electrical burns that dang near killed us. That kind of peeves me off actually. But at least I was able to not get stuck in that mine. Because I was panicking a little bit because I thought I was. I was like, no, the game put in another death trap. Is that like the new thing that the devs are doing in the long dark? Like while I was away, they were like, hey, you know what would be really cool? If there was like some stuff where people could just like get trapped and die. And I'm like, why? Why would you do that in a game that's already super deadly? It seems unnecessary. Why the music get all creepy all of a sudden? I don't... I'm not a fan. Hold on. Let me... Let me turn music down a little bit. Because it's like loud and really creepy. Is that too low? Oh, it didn't even save it. something down to uh, fix my can openers while I'm stuck here. There we go. Okay, it's better. Can I find anything else that's metal? Can we break like the TV down? Looks like decidedly not. New shelf. Wait, metal shelf? Ah, I can break this down to four. Okay. Some cloth. 
health off of this guy. I oh, mean, I'll clean this place up. Real good here in a minute. We got nothing but time while I recovering condition, so. Yep, make another fire, start some more water. Do a little rabbit hunting, I think. That's our strat. 85% chance and I failed. Sad face. For some reason my condition isn't recovering as fast as I, had, I was hoping it would. Man, that fire really boned us. An electrical fire. Or electrical burn. Search that guy. Feathers, don't mind if I do. Did I already look up there? In this thing? Let me take a peek real quick. This wasn't a cave, was it? either. I'm afraid to wander too far. I think, didn't that one time, like, the bear come up here? Scare the bejesus out of me? I'm worried about that happening again. I think the longer I end up waiting here, the, the better likely a chance that the bear is going to respawn. Um, so I'm here. I need to... How did I get up there? That's a good question. I think maybe I gotta go back here and up that way. Because didn't I go up that and I got dead-ended and I had to come back down here? I think I did. I need a guy. Alright, let's just wait it out. Every time I do, like, a time pass thing, I'm scared. I think, gosh, I can maybe only wait, like, one more day. Yeah. Alright. I'm not recovering condition very fast. I was hoping for a little bit more than that. rabbit I had did not last very long. Mm, be 
left on crackers and then we're gonna have to go so tonight's our last night regardless like I just I can't wait any longer tis unfortunate Bad, okay. Just get this a little touch up. There we go. Rifle's good. Our hacksaw could use repaired. Kind of ironic that you can like get scrap metal with the hacksaw and then use the hacksaw or the scrap metal you got from the hacksaw to repair the scrap hacksaw which is kind of funny All right, let's sharpen our axe back up to tip top condition if i'm gonna die i'm gonna die with everything in tip top shape for the next guy the next guy's gonna find me he's gonna be like oh my god this guy was loaded what he die from oh electrical burns Hmm, that's weird, considering there's no electricity anywhere. And then he will find out that during an aurora one time, he's going to get trapped in a mine and burned to death on electrical wires. Ah, that screwed me so hard. Redonculus. Guys, why? have only one question, and that is, why? Okay, here we go, into the night, our last night that we can, we can spare staying here, and then we're going to be forced to move on. Crackers are dense. They do require a lot of water afterwards. Alright, it's past some time. We got nothing but time. Is it going up? It's like just tiny little tink 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 little ticks. It was going up faster. Faster than that would be nice. Down to my last three boxes of crackers. We were in such a good shape for food and stuff, too. And then that happened. Ooh. Here goes nothing. there. 
I might have to take him for food. Oh, he's gonna bounce now. I half want to. I probably should. Really? I can't believe that did not down him. Did I miss? It's for Nick broadside shots. I can't tell with the irons in this game. It used to be so clear, like, how to shoot in this game with the rifles and stuff before, but now I like. Do I put it at the top of the crosshair, or do I aim, like, dead center? It's so hard to tell. Like, what do they want you to do here? I don't know. Screw it. I think I was probably aiming high. Great, I hear wolves. Wolves are always an awful sign. somehow get up to that abandoned mine again, but I don't remember the way. Apparently that way is a dead end. Do I gotta go like the long way around? God, I hope not. I'm kind of more worried about bears than wolves at the moment. I can always boom for that, but like, get the flare gun out, it takes precious seconds. I do have quite a few flares. Birds be a squawking up this way. God, it's like right up there. This bridge. There's gotta be a way. Hopefully, I don't have to take the long way. Hold on, I can turn this heater down a little bit. I may have to kill something and eat it just to have food. Tried to kill that deer, but apparently um, a terrible shot with the uh, the rifle. I'm aiming probably too high. I can't tell where to aim though. I wish I could. I'll have to practice. We'll get better at it if I survive. Uh, 
that a way up? Tell me that's a road. Not just a mountain. This could be a road. Yeah. Jackie, could you not? I can't do anything without one of the cats, like, hacking, maybe throwing up a hairball. I missed this guy before. He didn't have anything on him. You alright, Jackie? Jackie, it's too early for me to pause the recording, man. Ow! Son of a... don't need this. Like, please tell me I have painkillers. break every limb that I have trying to get up here. This better be something like a path. Otherwise, I'm going to be awfully salty. Okay. This is one of the trailers that I actually visited. I think it is. I guess I could have just came up that way. Well, it's dumb of me to uh, break my limbs on that. I guess let me check here. I could stay if I needed to, but we're gonna keep going. I'm gonna keep my flare gun out because I'm scared of bears, even though I've killed so many. But once my condition gets back up, I'll be more fearless because I'll know I can survive an attack. Right now, it's iffy. <laughs> it's like, could I? I don't know. Not quite half. And the last time I got attacked by a bear, it took probably like 60-70% of my life. So, I think I'm probably in the you-could-die range. From a bear attack. And I'm low on food. So, it was the one thing I was hoping to not be when I came here, was low on food. But we, we spent so much time crafting and waiting for the bear hides and moose hides to cure that, like, it ended up eating up all of our resources. And that, that is unfortunate. I think we're on the right path, though. Like, if that's that trailer, I think I might be head in the right direction. Oh lord, take me away from here. This got to be the right way. Hopefully the audio is good for you guys. Like I it's hard for me to tell. 
when I listen. Like, I have my volume for my headset turned way, way down because it's too loud for me. But, like, when I listen to it back, it seems to be about right, like, for game sounds to voice volume. If it's not, let me know, and I'll... Let me know, but in what way? Like, if my voice volume's too low, let me know that stuff, and I'll try to fix it. Um, what do we think? Yeah, this is probably the way out over here. Alright, so we gotta go back to Pleasant Valley, and then I have to navigate Pleasant Valley to get back to to the climb thing for Timberwolf Mountain. We're gonna have to do something for the climb thing on Timberwolf Mountain because I'm carrying way too much weight. I'm gonna have to make some trips up and down, probably. That could take precious time and energy. I don't know. We're definitely gonna have to kill like a deer or something to get meat to survive. I'm at that point now. Alrighty. I have plenty of lantern fuel, so we're just gonna burn that to get through here. I got all this coal I left. I might grab a couple pieces. Oh my gosh, did more respawn? Looks like it did. Then. stuff back there. I guess that's fine. I have more than enough. We got this beastie bear roll. So one thing that's not going to kill us probably is freezing to death. Now, starving to death or getting eaten by a bear, that could maybe do the trick. That might do it. know if you guys like the other view better I had like a sharpening filter on and that makes it look I think cleaner than what I'm looking at for the recording but I don't know if you guys like it or not if you like it let me know I'll turn it back on if not that's fine I can leave it just like this this is more accurate than what I'm looking at but whenever I looked at the sharpen filter I was like that looks pretty good actually so I kind of left it that way for you guys. I think this is the right way. I feel like cold respawned in here. Like the cold is all back. I didn't know the cold respawned. I, I was collecting it as if no more. I don't think loot respawns though. Yeah, once you check like the corpses and stuff. It's only like ground clutter and animals that respawn in this game. Otherwise, once you search a thing, like it's searched, it's over. We still got plenty to search in this game. Spawns, I won't feel bad about burning coal. I thought it was a finite resource. And you like you need it to, to do forging and stuff. But look, it, it all, all definitely respawned since I was last through here. I collected it all and I left it in the front of that building back there. And here's a bunch of firewood that I left. Scrap metal and Sticks and whatnot. Got all the coal. This, this cave is like littered with coal. My signs. This is one of the most coal-rich mines I've, I think I've been in. So 
so far. Sources just running in circles. God, I think we're good. This is definitely the way. Right. Man, the noises in these mines and stuff, they are definitely. We have a decent ways to travel in Pleasant Valley as well. And that's, you know, praying the weather holds out. If we get some nasty weather, I might have to, like, kill something and hunker down through the storm. I don't think we left very much food back here. I think I took it all when we came through here. Alright. Let's go ahead and eat another one of our last box of crackers. You know what? We're going to eat two. Now we're really low on food. And water. Although water I think I can manage. guy that might take up we're carrying a lot of lantern fuel so I won't feel bad about using lantern fuel if necessary that's weighing us down quite a bit all right so here we are Pleasant Valley the abandoned mine down here if we go down here I could check that store but then we got to go all the way up here to uh, get out of here, and that's, that is a long way. Look at the weather. I gotta say, weather in Pleasant Valley has been rough for me. Nothing but snowstorms and blizzards. I guess those are kind of the same thing, but you know what I mean, like, this is snow. When it's a blizzard, it's like a whiteout. So I consider this just like a snowstorm. But then you got the blizzards, which are really bad. rabbits or something game. Like really bad. Oh god, let's hope I don't break my stupid ankle down this hill. Run out of bandages, I might have to craft some. What is that down there? Is that a deer? If it's brown, it's down. I'm going to be hungry. It's a deer. Alright, we're about to figure out if I can shoot. I'd be better off hitting it with the bow. I'm a better bowsman than I am a rifleman on this game. Which is the exact opposite of real life.
looks like blood. Oh yeah. That's a hit. So like center mass. Lost my blood trail. That sucks. Gosh, it's like noon. Can't believe that deer got away from me. That's a good hit, too. Now he's gonna die out there. That's gonna be wasted. I starve to death with this much gear on me. I'll be off the salty. Let's see here. Whatever you can afford to lose, let's lose it. Gonna have to drop off some of these bows over here, I think. It's too much. shortage of wolves. I'll take a wolf at this point. God, I wanted that deer really bad. His blood trail just disappeared. That is not awesome.
there's a mine road. Oh, there's another deer. I'm gonna get another chance. God, I wish I knew where to aim. every deer on this map and it's going to get away from me. trail is gone. Oh, there's a rabbit. I know I can kill a rabbit. How on earth did the blood trail just stop? That's insane. with the bow. It's the rifle that I'm unsure of. What on earth did that deer get to? It drives me crazy. Alright, and why is this music so loud? Like, for real, why can't I turn this down? Hopefully it's not too loud for you guys to not hear me. Over. And 
then I'm just gonna have to, to go find food. Like, I don't have any other choice at this point. I can't freaking drop a deer dead in its tracks, apparently. It's two hits and no dead deer. Rabbits is the only thing I can get. I'll take it. I don't know. Sometimes there's a wolf up here. And at this point, I'm willing to shoot a wolf. It would be really nice if there's a few more rabbits patting around here. Oh, there's a blood trail. Blood trail. Did my deer come up here and die? Oh, please. Please be dead up here. Went this way. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, I need this meat. I'll take it all. Eight kilos of meat. Yes, please. Hide in the guts, I don't care about. Oh, I can barely move. But I need it. We're gonna have to slow walk our butt all the way up here somewhere so that I can cook and eat this sucker. God, that deer made it this far. That's insane. Unbelievable. I can't believe he trucked it from all the way over there across the river all the way over here that's that's actually crazy well this is awful I don't know, maybe I should have made two trips but I'm a one trip kind of guy you know there, there's a few different kinds of people in the world there's like the people, whenever you go get groceries or whatever, there's those people that, like, they'll make, like, 20 trips to and from the car. And then, like, I'm one of the people that I'll grab every bag and I'll make one tough, like, trek all the way into the house carrying, like, 50 pounds of groceries. <laughs> I just... That's it. You're either... You're one of the people that does it like that or you're the other kind of people. I think. I don't think there's... There's not a lot of in-between. Oh, uh, hold on. I'm getting really toasty. Uh, uh, uh. My headphone thing. Whew. Just it actually got, like, warm in here. Okay, so we're not gonna starve. Priority number one. Priority number two, I gotta get into one of these houses and cook this meat up. Which, I'm thinking the community center is probably our best bet. And that's where I'm gonna leave... Um, as much extra gear as I possibly can. Just, this is too much to... I can't do... I have to make a climb. So we're really gonna have to... 
drop off a bunch of stuff like lantern fuel may be at a premium I'm gonna have to like drop a ton of lantern fuel um, God it's it's right there but it, it feels so far away moving this slow we're gonna get there. You know what? It, it might actually go faster if I. I'll leave that out there and I'll come back for it. We'll get the fire going and I'll get a. Uh... God, we're already so much lighter without that, and I'm carrying 8 kilos of, of meat now. So I think if we get rid of like we eat a lot of this meat and we take it with us to eat before we get to the climb and I actually I offload these bows and that lantern fuel and stuff in here I think we'll actually be in a pretty pretty good situation let's hope that's the case I'll come back for that lantern fuel and I'll put it away in the community center that way I don't forget that I just like dropped it randomly in the town there. I'm so glad we found that deer because I was like, just thinking we were in a rough spot. And we were. <laughs> Unless there was food over there in that gas station that I forgot, and I don't think there is. Oh, there's like a basement to that, and it doesn't let you in. That makes me sad. Why would you put that there, and then just, just to taunt me? Oh man, we can can really do some cooking on this bad boy. Heck yeah. Okay. Do a wood match. I'll go ahead and throw these steaks on, get some water boiling, and then I'll go back and grab all that fuel. Actually, I'm going to drop off some stuff here first. Maybe we'll leave it in the fridge. Skin up. Okay. Um, take two bows with me. Alright, let's go get that fuel while those cook before it gets too dark. Still, I'm not light enough to run yet. We're moving pretty quick now. I can't afford to let those steaks burn, though. I need every ounce of that meat. All right, got our fuel. Nice to get under 40. 
we might be over like carrying food it's okay if we're over carrying food because I can always eat the food on the way and then we'll be under by the time we make that climb but if I'm not close to do I don't really don't want to have to do that climb twice a climb would really suck to do twice um, I can't scroll. <laughs> I hate that. Like, unless I click on it, it won't let me scroll. Alright, so. Alright, I guess we're just gonna leave most of the lantern fuel here. Um. Everything else I kinda need. How we doing? Oh. Seven minutes, six minutes, five minutes, okay. on there because we're going to do one more pot of water and then while the water is boiling I'm going to go ahead and harvest this rabbit we're going to end up spending the night here Finally, some food. Gosh, I think I, I turned up the hunger thing because it takes quite a bit of food to like satiate us. Starving to death is a legit thing that could happen. Um, let's see here. What else can we offload? Let me pick up all this stuff. We're going to try to sort our weight issue right here, right now. Fresh guts, fresh rabbit pelt. I don't. Right, so I'm almost 60 now. And that's, that's with all the meat. I did offload all but two bows. I have plenty of arrows. I have rifle and whatnot. We've only got two flares. Can openers. I don't have much for charcoal. Well, it's mostly water and food weight, which is what I wanted. Everything else looks pretty good. I don't know if I can offload anything else, really. Four cured rabbit pelts. And rabbit stuff is doing pretty well. Okay. Let's take a torch in here. We'll chill for the night. Just double check and make sure I didn't leave any thing over here. I don't think I did. We'll go across in the morning. Oh, I got some firewood over here. That's, that's nice. Alright. That was a rough day, I gotta say. I'm gonna go ahead and sleep. We're gonna pause it here, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next episode. Peace.